Beloved. Beloved. Or beloved. Mm -hmm. I say beloved. <laughs> it failed at the box office, no matter what it was named. Take a listen. I asked uh, my chef at the time, Art Smith, make some macaroni and cheese. <laughs> and I really, literally went into a tailspin about it. How much macaroni did you eat? Oh, I ate about mm, 30 pounds worth. <laughs> So in honor of Oprah, we plan to eat 30 pounds of mac and cheese this week. <laughs> We're asking you, what is your favorite mac and cheese in the Delaware Valley? And over the weekend, we were inundated with our first choice from Northern Liberties, yes. ladies and gentlemen, Darlin's Diner. Harry Darling is here. Hi, Good Harry. morning. Good morning. Sure. I've had your mac and cheese. It's pretty amazing. Thank you. What is the secret to great mac and cheese, just in general? For me, the, great, uh, the secret to great mac and cheese is a proper cheese blend. Blend, so not just one kind of That's cheese. That's correct. Give but you got to start options. with the pasta, of course. Yeah. So down in the first bowl down there on the end is your pasta. Yeah. Start okay. with uh, one pound of elbow macaroni. Tip okay. it up so we can sure, see. Sure, absolutely. We have a low budget. One pound, <laughs> yeah. One pound of elbow macaroni cooked uh, al dente because it's going to cook again in the mac and cheese. So a little uh, hard. A little hard. Absolutely. Okay. Okay. And then what you're going to do is this here, this sauce helps with the... Uh, the mixing of the blended cheese. What is that? Well, it's a classic bechamel sauce, which is a, a, a French sauce. It's very simple. Six ounces of butter, mm -hmm. six ounces of flour. Uh -huh. You melt that down. Okay. And then you blend in three cups of whole milk. And as that gets nice and hot, now you are able to melt in your cheese oh. blend. Oh, can I tell you, I just thought it was just cheese and noodles. I oh, no. Mean. What do you do this with a whip, a whisk? Absolutely, okay. with a whisk. Okay. And your first cheese blend here is Vermont white cheddar gotcha. with a little bit of smoked Gouda in it. Okay. okay. And then I love the simplicity of a New Yorker American. It really adds that wonderful... What's New York cheese? No, New Yorker is the brand name. It's oh, it an is? American cheese. But and by it's, New Yorker. It's by New Yorker. That's the brand name. It's key. In fact, uh, it's very, very popular with cheesesteak places. Really? It kind of adds that Philadelphia bend to it, well, we even like though it's called New York. Where do you get it? Uh, in the supermarket. Oh, I just didn't know to look for it. Absolutely. So okay. you put the blended cheese then into the pasta bowl? Yes. And then you mix it all together, and you would put it in these ramekins here, okay? Mm -hmm. Ramekins? And, and these go in the oven, and the oven's going to be at about 375, 375 for about 10 minutes. It's going to get nice and bubbly. Okay. But what's this? This is our topping. The topping is panko breadcrumbs seasoned with paprika, which is where you get that lovely color. Okay. Mm. Also seasoned with a teaspoon of butter, okay. a quarter teaspoon of pepper, and a quarter teaspoon of salt. When do you put this on? W after you're done mixing it and you put it in the ramekins, you put it on top to let it crisp the whole time. The that's correct. Well, it sounds like something that's simple enough that when you taste it, it Be all works guess. together. Be By the guess. way, Chef, not that you're going to have any competition, but go to our Facebook page, Fox 29, and vote for your favorite mac and cheese in the that area. That is heaven in a bowl. We'll see if it, anybody can beat you, okay? <laughs> All right, super. I'm up for the, the challenge. Is that what it is? It gives a little pop. And the white cheddar. That's important, the Vermont white cheddar. Absolutely. That's good stuff. And I always recommend putting a little bit of salt and pepper on it when you're ready to eat it. That's good stuff. Oh. Fat free, of course. Uh -huh. I'm a big Gouda <laughs> cheese fan to begin with. Very, very good. That All is right. a great blend. So, mac and cheese number one. That's right. Thank you for coming in. Thank a lot you. of people went on our Facebook page and mentioned you. Darlings Diner, Northern, Northern Liberties. Liberties. You're at the, uh, where are you exactly? We're in the Piazza. Right and the corner, right? And we're open 24 hours, seven days a week. That's why it's so awesome. So about four in the morning. That's right. After party and, and all And it's night. yummy. It's not just, you know, it's yummy diner food. It's, it's like. Oh, it's very good. And the cheesecake yeah. is heavenly. Thank you. By all the right. way, he has 462 brothers and sisters. <laughs> Is it 16 or something like 16. that? 16. I'm number 12 out of 16 kids. Oh, that is poor man. man. Thank you, Chef. Thank you. <laughs>